Good morning, my friends. It is time for verse of the day. You know, chapter 19 of the book of John is where Jesus is crucified. And so most of these verses are going to be a little tough. But I think as believers, we can find hope in these verses. So today's verse is John chapter 19, verse 11. And this is where Pilate wants to release Jesus. He's like, this guy has no fault. He wants to release him. And so Pilate takes Jesus to a place where he can be alone with him. And Jesus, he's saying, where is your kingdom? I mean, where are you from? And Jesus just doesn't answer him. And then he says, don't you know, I have the power to crucify you and I have the power to release you. And then we have verse 11. Jesus answered, you could have no power at all against me unless it had been given to you from above. Therefore, the one who delivered me to you has the greater sin. My friends, as human beings and as children of God, believers, we're told that we need to expect that we're going to have trouble and trial and tribulation here on earth and in our life. And God in his power and yes, his love and his grace allows things to happen in our life. And I know that there's people I'm talking to right now who are going through tremendous awful things or have had tremendous awful things happen. But our God in his love and his grace and his mercy has allowed that to happen because he sees the big picture. He knows that he can make good even from those trials and trouble and problem. And this one is no different. God the Father sent God the Son to this earth and God the Son is dealing and going to deal with tremendous awful stuff with the crucifixion but God the Father knows that it is for good it is for your good and it is for my good that this happen so my, my, my friends trust God even through the trouble because he loves you and he really wants what's best for you. My friends, I love you, and God's got this.